Hey, this is Rockman. Welcome back to more Super Mario Odyssey. stream I did figure out that I can get moons 7 and 20 over there, I see that. Uh, this picture doesn't look anything like where I am. Am I in the wrong place? That fire has nothing to do with anything, song. I'm looking for a moon on a roof. Description and picture are completely unhelpful. I have to look at a YouTube video because this description is totally wrong. there on that roof. Now, how the fuck you're supposed to get there? The guy in the video did something wacky. Like, there's gotta be an easier way to get up there. Did not touch you, Spike Pylon. There's 
nothing that this bird can get on to. Well, that works. I suppose there could be some invisible blocks somewhere. But yeah, the video did not show off if that was the case. Okay, um, so that was moon number seven. Moon number 20. Uh, this one I clearly passed because getting up on this roof was very hard. This one I didn't exactly pass. In fact, I was like, isn't a moon here? But it doesn't actually appear until after the big brutal battle. That's why I didn't get it before. Behind the outer wall checkpoint. Okay. Song will be here shortly. Uh, I think it's, uh, yeah, it's there. Saved it. <laughs> These enemies are just straight up assholes, aren't they? Didn't save it that time. Hope those blocks are still open. They won't be, I'm sure. There goes my six heart. So that is all of the moons that I can get. Let's see what happens if I scan the Bowser amiibo. Wow. It says there's no purple coins that I can get. The reason why I asked you if you saw Michael Knight was because there was a Knight Rider episode that I saw a couple weeks back where he finds this diver passed out on the beach and he's got the bends and he has to bring him to a hospital to go into one of those chambers, you know? Uh, shit. I closed a website that I needed. Right, 
So we have 79 uh, purple coins here. Kathy won't let me leave here, but let's see if we can figure out how many moons we have here. Hundred and seven, ten, twenty, twenty one, twenty two, twenty three, twenty four, twenty five, twenty six. Hold on. Now that is a total of four hundred and thirty three moons that I have, not including a moon in the Mushroom Kingdom that can't be put into the Odyssey. Um, but you know what, let's count that anyway. So, as of right now, let's say that I have 434 moons. <laughs> I hope it was okay for me to call now. I'm trying to figure out how many moons I actually have. Twenty six plus four oh seven. Plus there's one in the Mushroom Kingdom that I cannot put back into the Odyssey any well, not that I can put these into the Odyssey either. Okay. Were you going to share your screen? Yeah. Thank you for uh, being understanding that I was This was a, a friend who I hadn't talked to in a bit and wanted to know about my dad. And then it evolved into ex-boyfriend suck, and so I had to commiserate that ex-boyfriend suck. Not current boyfriends. No. But well, I'm the only one with a current boyfriend of the two of us, so. Hi, Ratmus. Um, how are you feeling and stuff? I did hear that you had some slight complications since the uh, choking. I hope you are doing better from that. And yeah, this is all the moons and purple coins that I can get before fighting this uh, battle. Oh, 
Okay, it was okay. Yeah. I'll be going to see Dad tomorrow with my brother. Sometime tomorrow afternoon. We are very lucky that Dad did not get pneumonia because he kept kind of coughing when they were removing the breathing tube. Dad's doing about the same or slightly better. He continues to, um... to, uh, improve slowly every day. Aren't the rainbow death legs adorable? No. Game tortures you multiple times with the same boss? What type of game would do that to you?
Zoda. Hey Zoda, how's it going? Seems like maybe I can do more here before moving on. So can you not reach those purple flames that are in the dancing lanterns below you? Purple flames in the dancing lanterns. Yes. Like jump down like you're gonna fall near death. So I got three shiny Pokemon today, shiny Inkays, uh, during the Pokemon event for Pokemon Go, and one of them is perfect. But it's kind of like, yay, it's perfect. It's, it's a completely useless one that's perfect, but okay. It is more useful than the other perfect shiny I have, which is an unknown. Which I feel like throwing in a dumpster fire. The other rabbit just gives you coins. She likes being upwind. I really don't know. My dogs do not do that. But then again, we don't usually use fans now. So. I haven't encountered that behavior. jump across or do something so you don't have to actually use that one to get the other two. That's how good I am at uh, cheesing the jumps. Yeah. Yeah, like that. What? I, you have to get at least one of them, right? Anymore. I'm talking about a song you love me. I can love you and not like you. Those are two different things. No. I, I know 
Maybe you should have stayed up there. I was about to say, why did you fall down if you're gonna do this again? But you get me. Hey Dynamite, how's it going? I'm not, I'm not entirely confident. Can I not wall jump on that part of the wall or something? It doesn't seem like I can. Oh, I'm screwed up. I have family in town, so I'm doing some family stuff, but nothing like a cookout or, or whatnot. Just... If you wanted to stay above, I have the other one. about talking to Ramus's ghost. Easy, and the easy star is hard. Usually how it works. Should be fun. I hope you enjoy dinner. I was able to see my niece today, which was awesome. 
Oh, Rickman, did you like the pictures I sent you? Oh, right, I was gonna send those too. Swimming over like, to the left. And I think you want to do fishing uh, to the left. I haven't changed any diapers, so there's that. I managed to get out of that part. Dumb. It disappeared. It's so damn hard to see.
I haven't played any of the Bayonetta games, so I don't know about them enough to comment. You just skipped over all the hard stuff to get that. Yep. Not fair. Do you go further? Or that? I can't see anything, but that's okay if you need to have the thing up. I'll just look at actual stream. <laughs> what are you getting? did the inputs to flip up, and the Pokio did nothing.
What are Mario's knees made out of? Did you say spaghetti? This whole body is made of spaghetti. Do you want to tell me? I can't see anything. Long pump. <laughs> other moons that I can do are two moons in a horrible sub-area that I hate. Yay! I mean, boo! I hate that sub-area too, so. my face and then place to warp to than this, right? Nope. Like, I already knew it was this moon you were going after, but it is such a terrible moon. This is not even the one that I thought it was. It's much easier. No, this is a terrible, terrible, awful thing. as the one I was thinking it was. Can you go straight? This is why this is a terrible moon. My controller broken or something? This is a terrible moon. I'd still rather do it than the other moon. Wait, 
Would you rather make Mario's face? Yes. everyone in chat doing? We're not a Pokio. We're making a live remake of Pinocchio. On Hanks' Geppetto. I'm wondering how they're gonna do the whole donkey thing and uh, make it creepy. Then Monstro is gonna terrify a whole new batch of children. Tom Hanks is going to be Geppetto and Pinocchio. Make a Bambi. Quiet, so I didn't break your concentration. Looking for the painting. Is there a room in here?
was going to count them up, but it should say 447. My math is correct. were past Bon Jovi on moons, at least unique ones. There's a long jump in this game? <sighs> that was one of your best moments. Did you 
you just say I had one of my best moments raging in Super Mario 3D World? I didn't say it in those words exactly. Okay, one of your most quotable moments. Any other Mario games that have long jumps? I'm not saving myself, am I? Am I digging in deeper? I still don't know what the trick is to make these things break faster. There's no trick. It takes as long as it takes. You swear to hockey pants? What makes hockey pants different than other pants?
what happened. Invincibility frames? Nope. This part is not even hard. <laughs> I sneeze because I lied. <laughs> near this hole that would have hit me and caused damage. Nothing. You didn't die from the hole, you, you, you flew into a wall. How does flying into a wall cause me to lose my transformation and die? I don't know. The game is glitched, okay, I will accept that answer.
years of playing this game have I died there or seen anyone die in that way. And if I have to start from the beginning of turning the game off. If I can't do the easy parts of this game, how do I expect to do the long journey's end? Holding the pro controller very hard with both hands, and I was like, this is the only way I can steer. Oh shit, how can I shake it at the same time? I barely was able to shake it enough. kill myself at this point. This ain't helping. This 
there a way to throw Cappy down? Ah. Uh. I can throw him up, but he ain't throwing down. Hi, Dean. Did you get your shitload of stuff done? One with the bullet. Hey, Doom. Three purple coins should be above the wedding chapel. <sighs> Fortunately, I can't get a life up heart in this area without going back, so that's cheating. seen you before in my life. Wow. Cappy just does not want to go anywhere near Chain Chomp. Yeah. <laughs> 
Yeah, that's not going to get it. How are you supposed to throw Cappy and have him hit him? Because it, it ain't a working. Well, I use the homing. So. I can't use the homing when I have the pro controller. I don't use the pro controller. It's just 87 times harder. Not in the mood. easier to capture things. But it's not easier to control Mario because of Joy-Con drift. It's a piss poor controller switch design. Joy-Cons were a mistake. With how easy it is, how much easier it is to throw Cappy, and how much I still want to use the Pro Controller, that shows you how broken and crippled the Joy Cons are. It's like have fun walking off a cliff. You know one of the rocks to the right of the entrance is a extra heart? I thought it was to the left, but then it wasn't there, so... It's the right.
trying to teach my niece to clap. It's not working. There are attempts being made. Please don't go off the fucking edge. I think if you just um, remote back to the checkpoint, it'll be fun. You can't catch Pokemon if you can't clap? What? what she games? apparently wants to catch a squirrel. She chose... We, we, did, we did two things. We had Bulbasaur, Charmander, Squirtle, and she kind of touched Charizard, but then she went straight for Squirtle. And then we switched it up to be like Squirtle, Charmander, Bulbasaur. And again, she kind of like poked at Charmander first, but then went ultimately went for Squirtle. So two times she went for Squirtle. And she has zero interest in Bulbasaur. Which kind of makes me sad. But then, then I can have Bulbasaur and I can kick her ass. So. This is exactly what my brother's going to do too. He's like, oh, you, you, you want the water starter, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I will take the, the grass. See if you can beat me. I, either my brother or I am. Or I am. Either one of us can be her rival. Although he did say that the rival has to be named Buckface, so maybe it should be him. So that is how many moons in total that I should have, including the one from the Mushroom Kingdom that couldn't be put into the Odyssey, but then again, neither could these 14. Not enough to get to the darker side, but almost. You should get the sick guy a doctor. I'm just gonna get a drink of water. Uh, you guys just watch Bowser and Peach. I need a few specimens. Wait. 
Bowser should be like, hmm, where is the satisfying sound of one's impalement? Not gonna fall for this old trick. Does Bowser's hair? Like it's so nicely curled and stuff. Mm. Quaffed. Yes. actually helped me for a second there. Yeah, I was guys. on the rumble for fishing. I never turned it off. play mobile games. I don't. Except for that 
time I scream blue on the DS, so let's ignore that. <clears throat> Did you know that every time you become Bowser, it's an automatic six heart? So what if you die and then that six hearts and six hearts and six hearts and six hearts? Infinite six. Have a good night. Do you need to feel better? And that is GG. Bye, Ratness. GG on beating Bowser, but we're a long way from 100%. sure I've failed that. I mean, I'm sure I've died there before, especially in the Bowser, in, in the 8-bit section, I mean. That's yeah. probably where I've died the most. Um, I've, I know I've seen people die also in the, in the breaking the block at the end section, yeah, that's although that's, that's a little bit more rare, but it's pretty easy to die in the 8-bit Bowser section because there's pits there. That whole time I was focusing and trying not to die. Ugh. Something in my mouth there.
And I've, uh, I've been busy, Zoda. I haven't even looked at the, uh, or I haven't added anything to the documents in like four or five days. What were you going to say? I was just going to tell you all about one thing. What you have? Well, we went Chinese. to my brother's in laws for lunch, and so we just did a massive order of Chinese food. <laughs> but Mom and I shared a piece of broccoli. So often spicy. Spicy. No. Don't you have his autograph or something, do? The Mushroom Kingdom. Power moons for some reason. It's all a dream, just like Mario Two. Why do you have to pay sixty frickin' dollars for his autograph nowadays? Is is that what he insists on? Is is that how highfalutin that he's become? That he now insists on that? Japanese version of uh, the Jump Up the Superstar, New Dog City Festival Japanese, which you get by hitting that. Let's uh, put these moons in here and see if it comes out to what I said, 462. Yep. I 
did not feel like doing the the whole brutals again right now. Uh, maybe later in the stream, or maybe next time, we'll see. But actually, let's make a quick detour over, as long as we're on the map screen, make a quick detour over to the Wooded Kingdom. Uh, now, I am going to hold off on opening any moon rocks right now. I think I want to continue with the with the way I've been doing it, getting all of the non-moon rocks first. Also, it defaulted me to my default outfit, I just noticed. So yeah, we're going to get these fucking cutscenes. But uh, if I head over here to the music boot, Boom box that's moving over here. Hit that a couple times. That's break free, lead the way, Japanese. Actually, it's listed here as Honeymoon Ridge Escape Japanese. So that's all of the, those two songs are from the boom boxes. The rest of the songs I should get just from Jam and Toes. Yeah, actually, let me look at the capture list as long as I'm looking at lists here. These are probably from the Mushroom Kingdom. Obviously, one of them is Yoshi. Uh, I wonder what the other four are off the top of my head. I can't. Figure it out. Um, actually, I'm not going to change outfits right now. Since the Mushroom Kingdom is the only one where I haven't got all the purple coins for one thing, we'll start cleaning that out. One of the seeds is right next to the garden. Um, three trees near the Odyssey, a lone tree near the sheep, and underwater. Underwater? Oh, okay. Underwater in the pond. In the dory.
Especially after the Bowser Moon Kingdom Hell. I think that there's another there's water here. Because I agreed with you, I was like, what? Wicked! 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 
Yes, the moon that Chirp would never understand. Cream. If I go get the ice cream, then you have to keep pressing A. So which do you want to do? Neither. Power Moon Wizard has got to be a trick. section in this world? Yeah. I think that's one of the moons my brother never got. He could probably get it now with practice and stuff. Just like when I, that was one of the ones he had trouble with. boring part of the stream where you're just pressing A and he won't make it stop even though I've asked him to stop. Be streaming this when you uh, get done with dinner. 
is, uh, you know, I'm, I'm still having fun in the Mushroom Kingdom at this point. Uh, the stupid sheep, I'll probably try to get those out of the way. Then there's the boss rematches. Maybe I'll try to do those all in a row or something. Do you think the pound down the things is available now? So what the, yeah, probably. Do you see any that uh, need to be pounded down? I don't think it's on that side yet. Hey Jolly, how's it going? Oh, I think I see it right here. Right here. No, it's probably on a different side. Get your dialogue Hi, box out of here. Lock it. There it is. It's right there. Yeah. I'm surprised I'm actually seeing most of these pretty well. They're it, it they're slightly raised, so it's um they're looking for like a dark edge on the corner of the square, and the white ones turn gray-ish, so they're a slightly different color than being um than being white. They're, they're like dark gray. Why are you doing the moat? Or are you gonna get, uh, what's her face? Are you gonna get Yoshi? I just figured there's no reason not to do it now. I'm not seeing. There's a big Goomba. Can someone confirm what the worst map is? Wet Dry World, you mean that's the best map? map is either Rainbow Ride just because it's too easy to die or freaking Jolly Roger Bay because that's just fucking garbage full of lag and garbage just said that to Jolly oh, 
Is that his favorite level? Well, he said my favorite level was bad, so. I don't know if it's his favorite level or not. Mom's Fortress is a classic. likes lethal lava land and song doesn't like that or no you hit sand uh shitting sand land right yes shitting sand land i just like to call lava land lava lava death death because i think it's appropriate because you're surrounded by death but i don't actually mind Shitting Sandland is the actual worst. <laughs> so, we've come to the conclusion that every level is the worst. <laughs> Except Bob's Fortress. Oh, well, I, right, that was my first opportunity. Now is my first opportunity to play Balloon World, but um, uh, maybe I'll continue with the purple coins and stuff first. Let's just buy one. Now look at all these outfits. We gotta waste our coins on, including this one. Um, okay, so the outfits that say new, which is everything to the left of here, those I have to buy for the game to consider it complete. Anything that says special and here on to the right, those were costumes that were added later after the game was released. So those are DLC costumes that the game does not count for 100% completion. Now, I might actually buy these all if I get a shitload of coins from Balloon World, which might actually happen. So we'll see. Um. Yeah, like, the thing about Balloon World, from what I understand, from what I've seen is, it's, it's not that you're going to get them necessarily quickly right away. Like, you can hide a couple of balloons, and then you can find a couple of balloons, and you'll probably get several hundred, maybe a thousand coins from doing that. And then if you just go about your business and wait, then eventually other people will try to find your balloon. And usually you'll just start, like, every so often you'll just get, like, a thousand or hundreds, hundreds of and maybe a thousand coins from other people. Mario Horror Game? No, I don't know what that is. Wicked! Wicked! Woohoo! 
Somehow I threw Cappy and hit the door and the globe. There's something else you can do that I never knew about. If you do this and s stay jumping on the globe like this, the game will play a little lullaby version of a song. Like, I think that's Jump Up Superstar. It might be different for each kingdom, or there might be several songs that it could be. Anybody know that? Because I sure didn't. Well, I have heard about that Winnie the Pooh horror movie, and that's apparently because Winnie the Pooh, the original story, is now in the public domain. <laughs> Yeah, that would be cool. Alright, now there's also a painting somewhere around here. The paintings in the Cascade Kingdom and Bowser Kingdom should be activated at this point. So we do have some hint art for Cascade Kingdom. I don't know what other... The hint art that was here in the Mushroom Kingdom, that is for the Cap Kingdom, I'm trying to think of what other hint arts are available right now, obviously not including the dark side. I think the Moon Kingdom, if I go back there, has a hint art that I think appears in Wooded Kingdom. I know there's some purple coins up on the roof, so maybe it's time to get Yoshi. Actually, I think I skipped some purple coins that were like on one of these towers. Yes, this one, and there's also some right there. There's probably some in that tunnel. Yoshi a sack. Okay, admittedly, I've been looking through Facebook, and I know you don't watch um, Marvel Rockman, but you do know who like uh, Nick Fury is, right? He's played by um, Samuel L. Jackson. Samuel L. Jackson, who is also Mace Windu. Yeah. Anakin, every five seconds of Clone Wars. I recognize that the council has made a decision, but given that it's a stupid decision, I've elected to ignore it. Which is essentially a quote from Samuel L. Jackson as Nick Fury. Ha ha ha. 
Wow. Gotta get all your Yoshi practice for all those Yoshi moons that'll be on the darker side. Yeah. Oh, she is a hungry, hungry hippo. I think the matches were just over easily. Brackman, I think you're just supposed to tell us that um, I'm going to let all these puns go. Everybody needs to shut the hell up. <laughs> Yeah, but egg puns can really help you get chicks. Feed them to the lions at the zoo? Yeah. yeah the roar here. The hell is clapping?
purple coins in the game. So no more need for the Bowser Amiibo. Bye, right. Doom. See you, Doom. <clears throat> I sense a presence which I know to be the old Jedi Obi-Wan Kenobi. I sense his presence, I know he's near, but I can't find him there or here. If he is here, I'll find him later, and he grumbled off that Darthy, Darthly Vader. That's that's awesome. That's a Dr. Seuss one. That's a good one. You do the person who wrote that, not me. Well, I'll solve you. Go back to helping me. Am I gonna get paid? No. I'm gonna get the six sheep. You're a sheep. Which ones have you gotten? There was one that was sort of halfway between the Odyssey and the Garden. There's one that's uh, right next to the damn corral, basically. And then there was one that was sort of on the way to Goomba Woods, but not quite all the way to Goomba Woods. Thank you. 
All right, there's like, I think two around the Odyssey, one on either side of the Odyssey, and I think you got the... There's a second one in Goomba Woods. This is where the last one is. Because there's like two in Goomba, like one on either side of Goomba Woods. Was I helpful? being unhelpful. There's something I need to do, so I need to take a break here. If anyone has to leave during the break, bye, thanks for being here.
That's a dinosaur movie.
Do you need me to add you to the thing? Or do you do that offline? We'll do that. Or off. Huh? What? I don't know what's going to happen here. Because... I think you might still have to have the online features. How do I do that when I'm playing as Ratmus, not Rockman? Well, you're going to have to link an account, which means an email and stuff. Like, you have to make a Nintendo whole account thing. Like, you can make friends with the Ratmus account and shit. I can't just... Which I... Huh? I can't just use my same normal account? No. Because it's... Because that's on a different profile. Well, that's stupid. Th that's seriously dumb and unacceptable. Uh -oh. We can do that off stream. Since I have the family plan thing. And then I can kick the Ratmus account off. It's like I vaguely thought about that, but I didn't like fully conceptualize it in my head. then you just fucking die. longer than I expected it to. Nintendo account with a new email and password and put them on your family plan just to play Balloon World. Yep. Even though it should be going from the same fucking account uh, as normal. Mm. 
Free basin. Can suck my dick. easy and nobody passed me so I'm probably fine. And the problem with this is much easier to hit these flowers if I have the Joy-Cons. Yes, I heard your mom sneezing, but whatever. She's allergic to Joy-Cons just like you. Yeah, I mean, GG. I don't know. It's, it's the first one. It's supposed to be easy. I don't know. Um, it's not what I want to do. I was trying to think, like, uh, well, should I start looking up moons besides the boss rushes? Mario's face, too. Gonna do the thing down there with the with the eight bit. I'd rather have six hearts for that. I thought you were about to say I'd rather have sex than that. Well, that too. <laughs>
wasn't sure I was gonna get that right. Are you a Jedi? No, it's from watching people do it blind in the past few weeks. Don't forget to hit the star thing there, too. Yeah. I'm just gonna leave that there in case I screwed up and got attacked by mummies. That's why I left it for a second. Have you done Captain Toad and the uh, Jamin with the mushroom guy with the headphones? Yes, both. done this uh, timer challenge, or have I done Mario's face, like you said, and then that really hard 8-bit area. Did you do those flowers that's like right beside oh, the yeah. Should be getting thirty moons. I can first thirty moons. Uh, okay, I'm studying this. I will not say anything for your first one or two attempts. Yes. One is just, one has the outline of certain things, this first one. The second one is only the outside line, like everything inside is white.
Harry's love song. Yeah! That's fair. I, I do want to see one thing before you start it. Okay. Um. with this? Hmm? Do you want to help me with this? Oh, do you want me to? Yeah, I don't care. Um. All right, hold on. Uh. Whatever works for you. Is this close or not? I, yeah, I, you're using the markers I would. So you're guessing roughly where I would do it as well. Now you tend to, yeah, Mario's eyes are a bit tilted like how it is, versus sometimes you try to straighten them out. I would, yeah. You really, just like that? Mm-hmm. Uh, lower. 
lower, lower, and to the left, to the left. I think you can probably even go lower. Sure. Truth. <clears throat> it's uh, kind of fucking derpy, uh, but okay. <laughs> it's not bad for for this second one. That's not bad. Oh, wow. You go push. Apparently close enough for government work. Let's check the capture list here. Let's check 49 and 50, just uh, for the hell of it. So the two capsules, as in Mario, these are both in New Donk City post-game. How do you become a letter? Was one of those a letter? M-A-R-I-O. Oh, okay. I was thinking envelope, like mailing a letter. Yeah, I know. I was at first, too. Oh, yeah, and you have rabbit. I thought you'd already done the rabbit. Thirty-one's the uh, eight-bit moon, and then it's the uh, rematches. Um, Thirty-nine, yeah, it's that one, yeah. Thir Forty is tourist, and then there's the art is forty-one, and that's in the mushroom kingdom. I mean, um, cap kingdom. There is a hat, a bonneteer and a hat after collecting Peach in the Moon Kingdom, and then there's Peach in the Moon Kingdom. Did you speak with the toad that starts the Where's Princess Peach quest? Actually, no, I didn't. She did that as well. Peach not appear in any other kingdom unless I talk to this guy? I think so.
Odyssey. detours here. from Bowser's Kingdom. go through here because I already sequence broke it but uh, here's how you get this moon uh, normally I don't 
number. That one I got, that one I got, and that's all I've gotten so far. This one here, and then that one on the moon. And that one I believe is in the Moai habitat. Sound right? Uh, I need to look at it again. What? Mm. One cactus, three bushes. Yes. Looking yes. towards that area that had the seed. Yes. Yes. That's exactly yes. Uh, but yeah, further to the. Right, now we go to the moon to get that hint heart. Also, look at a picture. Also, the fact that, yes, I got every purple coin in the game, but I haven't bought everything because I haven't been to the Moon Kingdom shop yet. Kingdom and then back to the Sand Kingdom, which is why I should have waited on Sand, but whatever. I need to be dressed as a doctor.
So it's the boss rematches and the 8 bit stuff and the uh, mushroom, right? Yes. Oh boy. And peach stuff. And I was 
thought it would be too fast. There. You've been watching too much static. Reminds me, I also got to play with the Sonic today. The Hedgehog? No. That was bullshit. Yeah, you clipped like a fucking corner. That was bullshit. Did you, did you see how Mario walked and entered the pipe? I didn't do that. That was my Joy-Cons. 8-bit 6 heart. Never seen that before. Mario moving to the left and right is not me, it's the Joy-Cons. Whatever, this is going to be the rest of the stream. Now stop and itch your head. <sighs> Mario, the Joy Cons moving Mario, not me. Just get the peach thing.
boss rematches time. If I can do that, I can do boss rematches. Five to go. I just got the astronaut outfit, dude. Welcome back. Made uh, some side trips to some other kingdoms. Uh, oh, actually, I forgot to talk to the tourist here. Um, Bought all the stuff with purple coins, did a really hard 8-bit section. I need, to, I need to talk to the tourist guy here. Let's go back to the Odyssey, please, Joy-Cons. Uh, so guess what? I'm on Ratmus, Ratmus in quotation marks account on the Switch, which is really just a side account. So I can't do Balloon World unless I make a new Nintendo ID. And link it to my uh, online account thing. Yeah, which is incredibly fucking stupid. Which I can do, and I'm happy to do. It. He just has to actually make a Nintendo ID and shit. So we will try to do that uh, in between this stream and the next. I forgot to get a six heart before the battle, so I'm going to immediately do a six heart. That's not cheating. I could have gotten it for free elsewhere. That's just to save time. Whoa. It looked like I phased through the boss only to hit the other tanks that shouldn't have even been there. Well, the Joy-Cons are 
want to do motion control, so I'm trying to scratch my face, which is constantly in need of scratching. Dude, wasn't it? Oh, I think it was. In... What the fuck is going on? I think it was during uh, Steffi Pie's stream last night. I don't know if you were there, but somebody said something about uh, uh, astronaut food in space not tasting good. And yeah, because it reminded me of that episode where it's like our, something like our taste buds don't work the same way in low gravity or something. I think like slaughtered here. Like food was a big topic of conversation last night. It might have been like right after Doom fell asleep or something. People were talking about mouthfeel and DK didn't well, I was talking about mouthfeel and DK didn't know that was a real word. I thought I would be better at this boss. I'm clearly not better at this boss. Too late.
So one of the food topics that DK and Steffi were debating, and I want to hear you guys' opinion on this, is um, if you have a sandwich or a burger, you know, with a bunch of stuff on it, you know, let's say there's, if you have a sandwich, turkey, lettuce, tomato, condiments, cheese, whatever, or burger, same thing, cheese, lettuce, tomato, whatever. Does it taste different if it's upside down? No. What do you say, Dan? I think there's a different, as you said, mouthfeel. Like, because typically your top teeth are going through those top pieces, like the lettuce and the tomato and, and the stuff. Um, and so it, it, it hits different parts of your mouth differently, depending on the construction, but the actual taste. No. Okay, so. And that that's, that deals with how your teeth go so, through. So it. yeah, it's, I mean, Steffi, I mean, Steffi was saying that it tasted different, and I was agreeing with her, but what we really were saying was like, we were trying to express not taste, but like you say, mouthfeel or texture. Because mm -hmm. D DK was saying it's exactly the same. There's there's no difference. But like my bottom teeth going through like say crunchy lettuce yeah. is going to taste very or it's going to feel very different than my top teeth doing it. Like DK wouldn't even believe a difference in that though. Like he was saying that a pie upside down is the same, even though the crust is on top and the chocolate is on the bottom or whatever. And I was like, I I, th I think I said like, my bottom teeth are expecting the crust, and if my top teeth hit the crust, they will be shocked and outraged. Which I was mainly wording that way to be funny, but I mean, you guys get what I'm saying, right? Because you're pretty much agreeing with that. Because well, like it's like you say, if there's if there's lettuce and tomato on my tenderloin, it's not that I'm tasting lettuce and tomato differently. It's the same tomato, it's the same lettuce, but it's hitting my mouth differently. So it's a different mouthfeel. It's a different texture. It's a different experience. It's a different experience. Yeah. Um, there's also like uh, people making odor or hors d'oeuvres. Um, and that's the fancy word for like if you're doing like cheese and crackers or something. God, and then you put, you didn't put the salt side down. You put the salt side, so so your, your tongue was not tasting the salty side of the cracker, but the unsalted side of the cracker. It's still the same cracker. Like you're still getting the same amount of salt you would before and stuff, but it's a very different experience. For, for like the tongue and everything to either have the cracker or not, or to have the, the, that salty bite on the cracker or not. Yeah, that was close. We want to go into the uh, how the barbecue was talking about generations, either last night or the night before, or wherever. And I was disagreeing with everything, except I didn't want to type it in chat. That's great because I was agreeing with everything stuff you said. Yeah, when I have a burger or whatever, I 
prefer to have the lettuce and tomato and stuff on top. That's the way I've always done it in my entire life. But a lot of places start putting the stuff on the bottom now. Like that tenderloin that I had from Culver's the other day, they put the mayo, lettuce, and tomato all on the bottom, between the tenderloin and the bottom bun. And it doesn't, like, like I said, it doesn't, it's hard to say that it doesn't taste as good because again, as you say, it doesn't, it tastes in quotation marks the same, but it doesn't feel as good to eat. And it doesn't like, it doesn't cover the meat the way I want it to. They didn't put enough mayo on it anyways, but I had to eat it in the car so I couldn't like fix it up myself. Um, okay, so I know there's that one down there and in the moat, but uh, I'm going for the other tower, which is this one. I think we got the hard ones out of the way. Give us last words. Not take me or I mean ring. This guy just wants to use the sacred binding band as a nose ring. Yeah, I gotta remember to watch out for these fucking puppies coming up out of nowhere. I don't see a heart in the ice anywhere.
stay down but the berry stayed eaten. Again. 
Well, clearly for me it's the double centipede whatever the fuck and uh, what was the other one I had trouble with? Uh, I don't know. Just mecha liquid? I think you're done. Yeah, I'm done. It's one of my fucking least favorite bosses, if not the least favorite. But yeah, I can pretty much handle the other ones. Okay, so 42 and 43 are tied to Peach or something, right? Peach, 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 Peach. One of them is Peach, and then the other one is that bonnet on Toad's head that doesn't appear for some reason. Let's just go to Toadette and see if there's anything else with her, rather than looking with my eyeballs. Eyeballs? You have eyeballs? Woohoo! Yep. Woohoo! Do you have other balls? Maybe. Okay, so one thing I could do is go to the dark side and do the whole brutal boss nonsense. So like I said, it's probably best left to the next stream. So then uh, we'll have to set a balloon world in between this stream and the next. Um, for now, I'm keeping my coins until balloon world starts. So, ignoring all that stuff, I... What I need to do is then start going through the kingdoms and getting all of the post-game stuff that's not Moon Rocks, and then Moon Rocks. So, let's think about whether or not I should continue the stream or stop here. It's 10.17, I've been streaming for almost four hours. That's a great thumbnail. Um, so nobody's streaming right now that I care about. So yeah, all purple coins are done. Um, so... As far as quests go, I think I've gotten every warp painting star. I think I've gotten every hint art that's not on the dark side. Um, as far as the quests, there is the... Well, there's Peach, obviously, in every kingdom, and then there's uh, the tourist is back in Sand Kingdom. 
What do you guys think, Song and Doom? Are you up for watching more Super Mario Odyssey? Um... If I fall asleep, are you going to use that against me? Like that time I fell asleep when you were doing the well? Yes, I will hold that against you. And Yes, um... There are... Like, Dead by Daylight has had... A DLC with other... You know, it's like Fortnite or... or um, or whatever, where it, it, they have downloadable content based on other IPs. Um, I'm trying to think of, I, I think they had a Stranger Things expansion for Dead by Daylight, and yes, there's a Resident Evil one, I got an ad for it when I was watching Steffi, and I'm sure there are many others that I can't remember because I've never actually played that game, but that's how that game is, so. Let's see what I can do in the Cap Kingdom before I even hit the Moon Rock. Song button. Well, there's actually more than I expected. 12 through 16. Um, I'm sure I can guess a few of them. One is this guy. Good to see you again, Cappy. Uh, say you mentioned a treasure. I have not found it. Blah blah blah. Where was the treasure again? Was it in the wooden crates? No, you idiot. Was it down in the fog? didn't say the next line. Okay. No, you idiot! It's on top of Glass's Bridge. Doomie's like Dr. Wily, if you couldn't tell. No, you idiot! Or, I mean, Dr. Light. Cappy, speak the next line. Not here. Oh, I remember. It was over here next to Luigi's balloon mug, you fucking idiot. Ricky! Ricky! 
Flying on the light pole. That's what I say. One of those moons is a free base. Isn't it? Is that all that's left? Fifteen Koopa free basing? What's going on on GBN tonight, Doom? Bird. Yeah. You want me to follow the bird? Is that what you're saying? Bird. I thought it was the day where they play non-Toho stuff, but that's tomorrow. Today is Saturday. Okay, I'm done. Flying away from me, so I was like, whatever. Bird. Like, Doom, let's say Shu needed somebody to sub for him. And, like, he asked you, like, is there any type of rule for what games you play on Sunday? Did, like, could it be literally anything that's not Toho, or does it need to have some sort of relation to something? Is there any rhyme or reason to anything that's played on Sunday? Like, if somebody else is uh, doing it that day. It just has to be a shooting game. A shooting game. Like, like a shoot 'em up like, not like a first-person shooter, right? That means Jim needs to play Link's Crossbow Training. Link's Crossbow Training. You know, I got two copies of that for some goddamn reason. Wait. It, Link's crossbow training is a... Is that a first-person or third-person shooter? I don't know. I just... That's the one I came up with. Just to be a jerk. Well, we all know what game Ratmus wants to... Wants Doom to stream. It's Ikaruga. What? All right. Here comes the bird, maybe. Here comes the bird. At least with this bird, you could literally just walk into it. It's a Goomba. <laughs> you can aim. Clearly, I can't. So. It's a little hat. It has. It's adorable. That needs to die. Seriously, bird. <laughs> Fine, I'm not getting that.
try to follow him back out as I head over that way. <sighs> I'm trying to think like of a, another stupid like game that involves shooting. Like I think in We Play, there's like a mini game where you're a tank, and it's very simple yet very difficult, and you have to like shoot an enemy tank while not getting yourself killed. You ever play that, Doom? Just trying to shake the pro controller, and of course it won't work. Asshole. Um, I mean, maybe? I thought I was thinking of a specific one, but uh, it's been so long. Uh, there it is. So, my niece has chosen uh, Squirtle, Squirtle as her starter. She had the three plushies of the Kanto starters. And she kind of pushed Charmander down a little bit and she completely ignored Bulbasaur. Uh, but she just kept going for Squirtle. And that means I take the ignore Bulbasaur. I think that's only right. And she can battle me. Wait. 
Peach and Tiara saw me flying by as a Goomba and knew that it was us. Something wrong. 
there. Uh, you need to, like, do that throwing the hat and changing your whatever closer to the ground, and I think you won't, uh, do the cappy knee lock. The falling knee lock. Not that it matters. Yeah, he does some dumb thing where like he captures a paragoomba out there. I don't understand why, but yeah. So give you a chance. That's the thing from from watching at least at least one guy who played this blind who was really good at these Koopa races. I see how re easy they really are. That's Cap Kingdom done. going to do anything else huge tonight, but we'll end by wrapping up with a couple of things here. Song's going to fall asleep, I know, right? Yep. shop and buy one more complete outfit. Let's do the shop in Bowser's Kingdom. Oh, we get that hint art.
City at tonight. We beat Bowser. Started the post game. Got a shit ton of moons. Dark side and darker side are both unlocked. Saturday. So as usual, hope to continue this game on Tuesday. And our total for the day is 585. For next stream, hopefully Song and I will get Balloon World uh, sorted out. Cap Kingdom is done. And then uh, maybe at the beginning of next stream, besides Balloon World, might start out the darker side, get that brutal battle done, and then that will unlock a whole bunch of hint arts, get those out of the way, get that other shit out of the way, and then probably just continue going uh, kingdom by kingdom, maybe doing smaller kingdoms first. We'll see. And uh, yeah, that's in Metro, and that is done, and this just needs a few more hint, uh, jamming toads, and that sounds about right. Save. Thank you, Song, for helping. Thanks, everyone, for watching. Song, Hi. are you still awake? Yep. All right. Um, like I said, hopefully Tuesday now... Hopefully also uh, Ratmus will be feeling better by next weekend, I hope, but uh, we shall see. Oh, hey, Fish. Uh, fish, any late night sprite tests from you and Zoda, perhaps? It's still uh, really late. <clears throat> Otherwise, yeah, that's the end of the stream. Bye, everyone. Bye.